Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back. I am DJ2. This is Kingdom Hearts Unchained. Uh, if you can see it, like, way down there. Uh, it's in tiny. We're playing it. Oh, I earned the title. I earned the title of Supreme Colosseum Tier Completion Reward. Awesome. Anyway, uh, what we're talking about right now, actually, is a very interesting thing. This over there is a comparison list that um, Temp, uh, Temp has made for us. Now, there is a more extensive one right here that actually breaks everything down by category damage everything um i'll cover my face there so we can see it for, fully for a second um and this is basically a basic comparison of free and paid version or premium version or whatever you want to call it um metals now why are we going to talk about this i wanted to talk to those this for a while um because a lot of times people are like, well, which metal is better? If I have a Riku, should I use a Riku instead of a Waka? If I have, and this is basically the whole thing. I mean, we are going to look briefly at this one, um, but the way that he did it was with um, the, it's uh, over here, you see the free version. So there's a free version, multi okay, so paid version multiplier, max strength with chip, max strength with paid. Um, so he does have like the free version right here max strength with uh, chip free and max strength with chip paid which makes a lot of sense because you can actually see it but because we don't really have um, that we're just going to kind of stay here and it's going to be blade of ragnarok thank you very much for the fall man enjoy your dancing bunny um it's kind of a given i would i would say um that the paid version is are always going to be slightly stronger than the free versions i mean that's just something that um i'm sure everyone can agree on let me make this just a tiny bit smaller over here there we go okay so what are these different versions we've got the free version and the paid version so whenever we talk about free versions or paid versions uh not kevin don't say that uh whenever we talk about free versions and paid versions we mean about the versions that you can only pull with jewels the metals you can only pull with jewels now that may be through any of the other things so we're going to go to the shop and take a look here um if you guys look way down there down there no wait down there down there down there if you guys look down there, it's tiny, but you can see it. So we've got uh, the deals, the big deals, the daily deals, and the small deals. So again, 600 jewels, 300, jewel, uh, 300 jewels, or 2,250 jewels right now because we're doing a big deal. Um, yeah, and, and don't write in that in, um, in color, please, Kevin. Um, so we've got the self, oh, first one, Selfie and Kingdom Hearts 2 Leon version A. So... Um, selfie is obtainable in the game at different air stages I, I honestly i'm sorry i don't remember where any of these are really available i kind of have an idea that um you are able to get um stitches doing um getting yen sids I, I remember that i remember lots of times i have gotten lots of stitches doing yen sids hey andrew uber lupus how's it going man um so there is that capacity. There is a capacity of getting um, stitches when you do Yen Sits. Now, Stitch Master Form Sora. I don't know how many of you gotten the Master Form Sora, but it's really hard. I have one. Um, and so those are the comparable versions. So whenever you guys hear me say, oh, the comparable version of this, the comparable version of that, um, you know, uh, I can say, Hey, you know, you've got uh, selfie or people walk in and say, Hey, who should I use master forms or stitch? Well, this is the thing. If you have a gilded stitch or a gilded master form Zora, then use master form Zora. Why? Cause master form Zora is going to be stronger. They're just going to be stronger on two different levels. First level stitches, maximum multiplier is 25%. Master Form Sora starts at 20%, can go all the way to 50%. So it's no comparison. Now, if you guys have been playing this game as much as we have in the stream, then everything on the free side, everything on this side right over here, every single metal right here, I'm sure that you've gotten more than seven, so you can definitely guilt it. So all you have to do is wait your time. If, if you haven't bought the VIP pack, the whole weekly deal thing, then you have to wait get the experience medals then wait and get the upgrade medals you know the 
the fairy godmother, Yan Sid, Fantasia Mickey, Cheshire Cat, whatever it takes. And then slowly upgrade them all the way to six stars. And then you can get the seventh one and you can guilt and you can guilt them. Um, for anyone who's asking if we can do it, if you can do a screenshot of this, actually Tempest will be releasing them in our Discord chat. So anyone who goes on Discord, you can just go there and get an actual full version because this one's kind of, I mean, this one doesn't look very good. Um, including, and it's not the full resolution too, including like this one. These are not full resolution at all. So, I mean, if, if you guys, you know, you can totally just ask Tempest. I am sure he will be releasing um, a much better version in our Discord. You guys can go check out there. Um, so these are basically the comparable versions selfie to kingdom hearts, Leon version two version a, and they are both magic. And you, he even did that. He put the magics, the speeds and the strength together. That's awesome. Thank you very much. Tempest for that. Uh, so Donald day is comparable to Mag magician, Donald, magician, Donald, Yuna to Aaron, Olette to Vivi. Uh, Jiminy Cricket, the Tinker Bell and Mini. Now we're gonna stop for one second and talk about Olet and Vivi, Hayner and Aerith, Kingdom Hearts 2, and Pence and Diz. Now, they are comparable because they both raise strength up. Now, Vivi, Diz, and Aerith are way better because they upgrade, they up the up the level of strength for one entire turn. Olet, Hayner, and Pence only upgraded for two including them so they will boost the strength of or they will boost the attack or whatever you want to call it of themselves and the metal that comes after right after them that's it after that the boost is gone so of course vv Aerith, and this are in a whole different cat they're in their whole they're in their category all their own um so you know just that's just something to keep in mind uh titus is comparable to mulan titus again is a one cost mulan is as well kingdom Zora version a to kingdom Zora version kingdom king so to kh Zora version b uh riku to kh2 Zora version a hainer to and you guys can keep reading it there um but again the ones that people are always asking about are what should i use because actually this is what i use a lot i i have been a great big active a a advocate of all the one cost medals selfie um titus stitch waka and is there another one no there isn't another one cost one no there isn't um no that's it so those are the one cost medals which are awesome i mean to me they are great because you can really put them in your in your um the, they just make you last up and if anyone if you watched a couple other videos that i've done recently like a, i did a coliseum video very very recently where um you guys can completely see what happened to me when i ran out of um when i ran out of um what's it called out of special when you run out of special it doesn't matter how strong your 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 uh your metal is it doesn't matter what special that that uh that blade has um or that metal has you're just out of special and you can't do anything except tap or swipe so thank you very much guys this has just been a basic little introduction like i said there is another version that we're going to go into more deeply but this is just this is the the first part of comparable metals uh, i'm gonna ask him to do one <clears throat> if he can a chart right next to this one we're gonna add to it where there's gonna be like um the base strengths and uh you know and um and defenses of the metals and then we're going to talk about the metals that i recommend that you take the six stars out of this list and the ones that i don't recommend you take six stars and then as always we're going to keep talking about each individual individual metal if you notice there have been a couple of metal spotlights but it's been the new stuff um there hasn't really been many of these metals really in the spotlight so that's what we're going to start doing we're going to start doing in on stream well you know what i might not even do it on stream actually um, in fact, what I might do is I might do these off stream so we don't spend too much time on stream where I'm going to go one by one through all of those metals. We're going to do metals. I'm going to do metal spotlights of every single one of those metals. I'm going to talk about them. I'm probably going to ask either I'm probably going to ask Tempest or uh, I'm going to ask uh, Alice or Quinny or someone else, you know, um, who has a lot of experience in the game, much more experience than me. I'm going to ask them to jump on Discord with me, and we're going to do. I might even have their, if they have Skype or something, uh, I might even, you know, put their their camera down there and we can talk with them or down in the little one. Um, yeah, so we're going to be talking with people where you guys can just say, okay, you know, what's your experience with this? And 
I want to bring, I want to talk about it from the entire point of view because the level that we're talking stuff in the stream is like people are talking about things like guilted and with Max um, Chip and Dales and all these boosts. And we're talking about, you know, how hard a metal can hit like 30, 40, 50,000. And if you guys haven't seen that yet, I mean, come to the stream because. I mean, even I have a metal that I can hit almost 40,000 with. Actually, I have hit 40,000 with um, because I boost, 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 and then, you know, put the metal and it all blows up. Um, and, oh, and especially if uh, there's actually here, I'm going to drop a name there. Brandon. Brandon has a guilted. I think it's a Leon. No, it's not a Leon. I forget what it is. Is it a cage cloud? I think it's a cage cloud. He has a guilted one where I can use him and I've actually the the metal hits 13 times and with all my boosts I've actually been able to hit uh 3500 each time a little over 3500 which is comparable to 38000. So yeah. <laughs> so there's yeah, there's some really really crazy um things that you can start doing, but what I want to do with these is I want to do when I do the metal spotlights on these, they are going to be very much a start to beginning. Uh, sorry, <laughs> start to beginning. <laughs> They're going to be very much a start to end kind of. So we're going to talk about like selfie. We're going to talk about selfie from a very basic point of view. And we're going to talk to about her all the way up to, you know, guilting her and how powerful or how to use her. So keep an eye out for that, guys. Those are going to be coming out soon. Um, probably next week I'll start releasing those videos because I'm going to start getting together and I'm getting together people too. Uh, there's a lot of people, you know, there's people in the stream, there's people on YouTube that I want to do collaborations with. So if you guys, you know, have a really great metal or your favorite metal, um, if you want to talk about your favorite metal and you, it's been the metal that saved you and it's on this list over here, you know, leave me a comment, uh, send me a DM on Twitter come into the stream, send me a whisper, send me a message on Discord, send me a message on Facebook, post on my wall. There's a million different ways to get a hold of me. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I have been DUJ2. This has been another quick little classroom. Well, it's not quick, though. It's taking a while. And actually, we're still on stream, so I'm actually going to draw the winner of the next party spot. And the winner is... OGRB King CV, who actually also streams on Twitch this game. So I'm actually, you know what? I'm gonna leave his um I'm gonna leave his link in the description as well of this video. And uh again, guys, thank you very much for watching. If you want to check out more people, I you know I'm gonna start doing that too. If you want to check out more people who stream this game on Twitch, I'm gonna start leaving links in the description of other people that I I'll ask them first if it's okay with them if I do that. Uh, you know, just give them a follow on Twitch and then whenever they go online, you can see when they when they're online so you can go check them out. Thank you very much for watching guys. I have been DUJ2 and the little O there makes it look like I have a little little poof there. It's like Goofy. Have you seen that Goofy has that little thing on the back of his head? He's got the little. Thank you very much, guys. I'll see you next time. See ya.